The Dow formed a doji today, a little bit of a distance away from the uh, T-line. The T-line should come up, but it, we might see some profit taking back to the T-line. And the NASDAQ did a bearish engulfing signal, a left-right combo. Good probability it could come back and test the T-line. So this, with stochastics and starting to roll over, may be uh, an impression that we're going to see a few days of profit taking going on. You might consider shorting June live cattle at anything below uh, oh, 111.70. Uh, if it trades back, or if it trades lower, notice you have kind of a failure of the T-line on its way down to the 200-day uh, moving average. Short on anything in the lower part here, around a, uh, one, uh, uh, what I say, 117, the 117 area, uh, with the anticipation it could come all the way down here. Tomorrow's tomorrow night's training session is going to be oriented toward finding the right signal setup at a resistance level where we might have a big price move like this. With the information that is built into candlestick signals, it becomes very easy to identify where and when to get into a trade uh, that has big upside potential. We'll see you in the chat rooms.